The fight over a proposed West Valley casino went to court first. Now it's going to Congress. Mike Watka shows us why critics of this casino are placing their bets on a new bill. Mike? Uh, yes, indeed, Bev. It's a high stakes battle that has been waged for the last couple of years, and now opponents of the casino about to play their latest hand in the nation's capital. The main point of this bill is about protecting not only America's Indian tribes and their uh, agreements, but the rule of law in general. Flanked by a who's who of local, state, and tribal leaders, today Congressman Trent Franks taking aim at the controversial proposal to build a new resort and casino near the University of Phoenix Stadium, with the congressman saying he will soon introduce a bill to stop the Tohono O'odham Indian Nation from building the casino on the 130 plus acres of land that the tribe owns in the area. My heart isn't to attack the Tohono O'odham people. Uh, I wish them nothing but the best. But their leadership has failed them in this regard and has broken faith. We do not support off-reservation gaming, which is what the Tohono O'odham leadership proposal is centered on. The land in question purchased by the Tohono O'odham Nation as part of a deal after tribal lands in southern Arizona were taken to build a reservoir and today the Tohono O'odham Nation issuing a press release calling Congressman Frank's efforts a desperate tactic saying the special interest opposing the project have been unable to win their case on the merits and now seek to change the rules in order to preserve market share and control. Seven decisions by the courts and federal agencies have affirmed that the nation has followed the law every step of the way. All for it. Yes, sir. Not concerned and bad influences for families and stuff? No, no, no. I don't think it should be here. There's a lot of high schools around. There's too many kids. It's, it's not a good area. Yeah, I support it. And today on the streets, a very unscientific poll with most of the people we talked to supporting the casino and its promise of jobs and money. I support it. I think it would be, I think it'd be cool to bring a lot of people down to Glendale. Not concerned about the impact on the lifestyle or whatever? Not at all. Not at all. We got casinos all around town anyway, so what's another one? Now, opponents of the casino say that if the Tohoda Odom Nation is allowed to go forward, this could jeopardize the gaming compacts that the state has with other Indian nations. This one far from over, and of course, we will continue to monitor. I'm Mike Watkins for 3TV.